there are three states a document can be in. These are as an original reference or reference, a duplicate or a link. I'll go through each of these in turn. If we select this iStream document and look at where used, we can see that we have multiple references to the same document in several places. Two on our desktop, one in a basket, one in a folder and one in a file cabinet. The references point to exactly the same document. It is the same document, it isn't a copy or anything else. It is the same document at the same time. Every user that has access to a reference of this document can view the latest version of this document, add their annotations and know that everybody else who has a reference will be able to see the changes they have made also. Here is one reference on the desktop and here's the other reference. A duplicate is something different. This is a pure physical copy which is detached from the original. Remember how we created a duplicate previously? We right mouse on the document and select a duplicate. It opens up immediately the properties form for the document. I've called it duplicate iStream so we can see the difference. Here we have the new document and if I select where used on this object there's only one instance or reference of the object in the whole of key file and that's sitting on my key file desk. References are extremely useful for sharing information between users. Duplicates are useful when you wish to use an existing document as a template for a new one. Now on to links. If I select my document and do right mouse I have a send to option. We have URLs, shortcuts and references. You've already come across references before where we select a document and drag a link reference to the Windows environment. A URL is a web shortcut to the document and takes up very little space indeed and is used by sites who are web browser based environments. Email attachments are also links. Notice here I have an empty email message. I'm going to take my document with a left mouse and drag and drop it on to my email document. It becomes an attachment and notice this is the same type of attachment, a link reference, as we had to the Windows desktop.